What's going on, guys? How you doing? Hey, uh, we'll be starting a new game today. It's called Necro Story. I don't know if you guys heard of it, but however, uh, this game is very interesting. It's uh, made by Rabio Games, I do believe, is coming out to October seventh. Uh, this game right here. Okay, well that was weird. Anyways, um, yeah, I uh, I was recently contacted by a game studio called Rabio Studio, or sorry, Rabio Games, and uh, they made this game called Necro Story. I thought it'd be very interesting to show y'all. And I usually make reviews on necro-based games. Um, that includes like Necrovision and a few other games. However, um. Yeah, this game comes out October 7th. It is a turn-based adventure game. Uh, just the description base is Necro Story is a creature collecting RPG where you play as a kind of evil necromancer, more into undead shenanigans, than saving the world. Command quirky minions, outsmart foes, and snag their souls to power up your team. Expect strategic combat, laughs, and plenty of mischief. Uh, I am very, really excited for this game because the game overall, it does look fantastic the way it was built. I don't know how long this game take, took to make, but it does look fantastic. The art style, it's very uh, gritty. It kind of looks like it's done with like a, like a brush marker or something of that level. Um, but yeah, we can uh, definitely set this up very shortly. Um, but yeah, uh, we will turn over this real fast. One second. Let me just kind of get this up and running. We'll go over to the main screen here now. I'm going to pull it up. I was originally just going to have you guys set up on the uh, screen to kind of have my scalp kind of like separated from it. But since I can fully run myself and as well, I am going to keep myself up on the screen and I will have everything set up accordingly. The game is a little loud, so I'm going to turn it down just a tiny bit. And I'm going to... Uh, adjust some of the settings. I do like the music, however. I really like the brush strokes, the way it's actually animated. Uh, let's see here. Audio. Turn on the music. Let's go about 45%. That sound. Voice, we'll keep it about there. Master as much as such. Pretty easy uh, concept of the controls. You have the, of course, the WASDEF. Inventory spell book. Nothing too out of the ordinary when it comes to these kind of games. Some of them are kind of questionable. But this one is very put together. Select spell four. Four. It's weird. That is a little something out of the ordinary. I didn't... Okay. Not really sure what that's about. <laughs> Awareness rolls. Just for like everything together, I will have the scale names up there. I'll have awareness rolls just to kind of have that out there. Just to be interesting. I imagine it's kind of like perception check. Uh, long descriptions. I will keep longer. To, actually, let's move on. I mean, outline. Yeah. Selection circles. Yeah, just to kind of have that all up there. However, I'm going to turn off screen shakes. My, me personally, I'm not a big fan of blur of screen shakes. Uh, not sharing yet. I do want the devs to collect my data very specifically. This is the reason why I'm testing it, why I'm reviewing it. Okay. New entry. Mobs capture. We'll go to the first one left. 
Uh, what would the let's go with easy? Just kind of like the gentleness. I will have the testing all different forms of them throughout the stream. Um, mainly the one for v YouTube. I'm gonna just go through the first run, clip that out, send you guys it. Uh, however, for the main stream, I'm going to test all the difficulties to see how bad it really is. And I'm sure they have their own tester team, as most game devs do. I mean, even I have a tester team, according to like a few people that I work with. Um, for challenge players. Okay. Looking to relax experience with easy to win battles. Not too bad. Perfect destroyers. Combat is merely affordable. They have a hardcore mode. When an allied mob dies, you will have to capture their soul. If you don't, it will go for gone forever. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Ultra hardcore. When a mob dies, it will be gone forever. Death of the necromancer or V VV causes permanent game over. Interesting. And they have custom rooms that go in between. That's cool. It's really a tailored experience. I like how they do that. They have the prefabs of each experience. And then they have kind of your own variation of tailoredness, which I like. I like that they did that option. That's that's good. That's that's really good for devs to do. More devs need to do this, especially when it comes to indie devs. I know they want to make it basic and everything, but I like this experience. I like that. I'm going to go with easy. Mail? Oh, you can wait. Oh, okay, so you can change depending on uh, male and female. I didn't know you could do that. However, for me, I'm going to have Necro Leviathan. Mostly, you can change. Oh, I didn't know that. You can change your karma status. Overwhelmingly evil, mostly evil, very evil, overwhelmingly evil. Uh, I don't know what this means. I assume this is based on the choices, maybe, of more of, like, possibly how graphic of nature the person might be. Because this isn't a, uh, this isn't a difficulty, but it doesn't really describe what it is. Uh, if you are watching as well, um... Let's call you RG, because I don't want to like mispronounce your name. Uh, if you want to have a description based on this karma system, because obviously karma is very exp explainable when it comes to D&D characters, but people are not f formal or nor the formalities of D&D &D or how karma works. It would have be a really good idea to have like a description right here of what the karma affects. Because not everyone else is going to know that right off the bat. Also, I'm not really sure what you guys put for the game devs. Uh, what the karma actually controls as via the story. Because karma kind of controls a lot of different decisions for different games. Because I know especially for me playing, say, uh, Pathfinder uh, Wrath of the Righteous, where I really, really enjoy. The karma system really gives you different options for dialogue. Uh, mostly evil... So I'm guessing this is like on the lower scale, very evil is like secondary, and I'm guessing overwhelming evil is like all the way evil, 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 chaotic kind of thing. Uh, this is more of probably lawful evil, and this is more of like a neutral evil. Uh, I'm going to go with the very evil, just so I have like a, a neutral play. Because I usually play either chaotic evil for characters, or I normally play um, lawful evil. I never really neutral evil or neutral chaotic, but we'll see how it goes. I am I will have different karma systems for each one just to see what it controls. But yeah, let's see how it goes. Long hair. So there is customization. For the hairs, which I do like a lot. And balding, short. Punk, that's cool. Neglected, old-fashioned. <laughs> that is funny. Mid-length. Punk long, that's badass. Just chrome dome it, long. Very long. I'm kind of more of just long. 
Like that's just this is my my shoulder length, so I'm gonna go with that my character. Different types of noses: small, long. Oh, that's really interesting. Thick nose, normal. Let's go with a thick nose. I kind of like that nose. Hat. You can have different hats. That's really interesting. Owl, sorcerer hat, priest hat. I like that that's an option. Dad's hat. They have signs you can put on there. That's kind of cool. I like that that's a customization option. Interesting. Different earrings. You won't be able to see them, but that is interesting that they have those combinations. Facial hair. Goatee. Very small. Hipster beard, small beard, long goatee, interesting. A mustache, mustache you a question, big mustache, interesting. Love that, honestly. Beard and mustache, goatee mustache. It's kind of like a Van Dyke looking thing, goatee. Sadly, they don't have stubble in here. That's more of something I would go because ne my character, Necro, is more of a stubble character. So that would be something interesting to add. Like, someone wants a little bit of stubble, but doesn't want, like, the full beard. I think the closest thing would be probably this. Uh, let's go with brown. So we're gonna go with this one. Green is more of a... Uh, which I did send this to. It's like, the, the generic character looks a lot like my friend Leafy Van Gogh, which is another VTuber. Sky says you smell from the front seat. I do. Are they driving this crazy, uh, this crazy taxi, if you will? I'm just going to pull out my gun and just say, back off. If I choose to smell, I choose to smell. I will clean later. But anyways. Um, yeah, it looks like my friend Leafy Van Gogh. His kind of whole get up with the purple and the green. It's very interesting color combination. Because not a lot of people choose those colors at all. Um, which I think that's also why they chose that. So anyways, we're going to do brown hair. Fit my necro. And then we're going to have skin color, not that yellow. I do like that they have different colorations, though. Blue. I think it's for this Homer Simpson. That one's cool. Though. I'm probably just going to go with this one, just have the normal necro look. All right. That should be good. Belt. We have a belt option? Oh, that's hell. That's hella cool. The JRPG style. That's funny. The rope. The wrestler. Oh my god, that is so comical. I do like that though. Default shoulders, spikes, skulls, armored. I do like that armor actually. Shiny. Yeah, this really matches those. My character can actually do the robe. So they got simple, classy. Let's go with classy. I like classy. So we got brown, we got that, we got black. I do, have the, I do like the black though. Purple, pink. Pink is actually iconic as hell. I love that. Uh, I wouldn't not gonna have this character, but I'll have for the next. I do like that though. Purple's cool. The brown? It's not very brown. Um, that's still kind of more pink. I don't know if you guys see what I see, but it's just it's not very brown I think it'd be really cool to have like more of like a darker here but like the leather be brown I still like it though it, it is it is interesting I'm gonna go more of the black the black stone gray though let's see select the school of magic you specialize in affliction school of ma magic revolves around damage over time poison crowd control and curses by specializing in the school of magic, all spells in this school will be more effective. Darkness. The school of darkness. Magic revolves around around powerful direct damage spells. Some of them also have chances to kill non-boss enemies in one blow. Oh, that's cool. Summoning. Summoning is obviously the undead creatures, which is really cool for necromancers. Lifesteal. The Lifesteal school revolves around your spells during the life of the earth. I like that a lot. Dark Packs. Dark Pack allows magic to use the dark ancient demons. After summoning. Pack with demon. 
Okay. The special item school, the pass of the dark packs will be improved. Not recommended for new players as these spells are hidden. Interesting. I'm not really a big fan of affliction, but I will try that at one of the playthroughs. Uh, darkness is cool. I like that pen. I like that a lot. I'm probably going to go with lifesteal because lifesteal is probably one of my personal favorites. I do like the summoning, though. I'm going to try on one of the playthroughs. Uh, I'm definitely going to go with Lifesteal this time. Mainly because I just enjoy Lifesteal overall for most of the different types of playthroughs. Since I can't use my fists to punch people. At least that I know of yet. I'm going to go with Lifesteal first. The longer I stay alive, the better. Be careful, guys. The demon shouldn't be far. A demon? D -d 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 demon? Nonsense. One of these demons. Seen these demons since the end of human reign. Speaking of humans, look over there. They're like mushroom people. It's adorable. Aggressively sleeps thy necro. Uh, uh, human? It seems alive, or at least not completely dead. Impossible. Humanity has been extinct for years. That's not a word I'm con- Dammy? Dammy crap? Alright. <laughs> nice conjugation of words there. He'll sure stomp us. Our craft- Mushroom soup will with our bodies. Wait, sorry. Or craft mushroom soup with our bodies. Okay. Don't panic. He's asleep. But it's too dangerous to leave a human alive. Kill him! I wonder how the human survived the humicide. Something should be wrong. I'll cast the pheromones again. Asking for reinforcements, just in case. Aggressively pounds Mushroom down. Jeez, they sure go all out to kill a sleeping man. I'm so proud of the brave soldiers. Such proud for the great soldiers. Captain, help! He's fucking alive. Look at his horns. Horns! We did, boys. There's horns in the game, finally. There's a Necro game, finally, with horns. Let's go! <laughs> what? What the? Where's the demon coming from? And where's the human? Fight! Do they? Do they go first? Oh. Oh, there's a time for it? Because they're just beating my ass. So I have to actually click them in a certain variation of time. Victory. Okay. That actually cause it? Doesn't feel fully turn-based, if that's what if that's the case. Because they were just attacking non-stop. May I find that I have to click all the screen like a mobile game? Ooh. Wow, this looks like there is fighting up there I hope I'm not too late I'd better hurry oh this is Vivi oh she's cute I like the face model the hair looks good it's a cool looking character there I found him and he's still alive well kind of I never thought I would have to do this someday, but there's nothing to lose anymore. Simply nothing to lose. Anima Sacrum. Reversio. Is she like a sorcerer ghost? That's interesting. Seems like it worked. Are you okay? But where am I? And who... 
Who am I? Oh, jeez. He has amnesia. Well, that could actually simplify a lot of things. I'm kidding. I'm Necroviathan, the powerful necromancer. <laughs> you're telling me you're Necro, the necromancer? Yes. <laughs> and you are Vivi, that white mage who put me in a slumber back in the days. Oh, shit. Oh, this makes perfect sense why he's immediately angry. Prepare to die, you. Dot, dot, dot. Hmm. Seems like someone's already did the work for me. But don't worry. I'll get my revenge in due time. Don't you worry. This kind of reminds me of, like, similar to, uh... What was it? Lord of the Rings, um... Shadow of Mordor? And Shadow of War? Where they have, like, the wraith that's attached to the, uh... The guy. Yeah, yeah. Now listen... Because the shrooms should be on their way. I hear voices this way. Call for reinforcements. Go, go, go. They're coming. Let's get out of here now. No way. You won't get along with the good old no time to explain. I always get caught off guard that word. Damn me crap. Damn me crap. A human? Alive? How? And a g g g g g ghost? Dead? <laughs> Enter. Fight. Spellbook. Inventory. Team. Menu. Mortar. Okay. Death. And infectos. I'm guessing like. Poison? Fight. Fight. Ah. Uh. Squig. When you kill an enemy, their soul tries to reach the interval. If you're quick, you can grab it and absorb it before it runs away. Grab it. Grab the soul. Grab it. Oh, it's it's right click? Oh, okay. Got it. Congratulations. You absorbed the first soul. Absorbing the soul gives you a bonus mana to the Himete. Casual as many souls as possible. Attack. Infecto. Infecto. Aha. Let's go. Fantastic. Level up on what's a two? You're already at level three? You're stronger than the main character? Alright. Plus eight, Mete. 23, all souls captured, 20% XP. Okay. I have pets. Is that all you got? Your spells became ridiculously weak. What is wrong with you? Look at his face. Look at that. That's hilarious. Hey, I've been in summer for a very long time. I'm groggy for crying out loud. I just need a bit of practice. It will all come back, I'm sure of it. <laughs> That's pretty good. I like that. And... Speak it for yourself. Your attack spell barely deals any damage, and your heal is crap. May I remind you that I'm dead? It's quite a feat for your ghost to interact with the living ones. That is, it is actually. That's pretty insane. Jeez, she's so suspectable. All right. The Waz death. Okay. Something tells me to go around here. Okay. I was expecting like a chest back here for some reason. Usually at every start of the game when you're actually able to walk around, there's like a random chest behind like where your spawn is. I'm kind of surprised there's not. That's a like, kind of like a cliche thing. Oh. Wait a second. Hold on. 
Okay, so the, oh, 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 okay. Interesting, there's two different locations out. So there's this one, which leads downstairs, but there's this one that leads out around here. Interesting, what is this? Find out. Oh, there's also a mouse thing too. You can control, Ooh. Sorry, I got distracted. All right, let's keep going. We have down, nothing here. Nothing there, nothing there. Right. Nothing over here, but there was this little chest. So that technically I was right. At the spawn, there's always like a little secret thing there. So that's good that I found that. Let's go down. Out of the way. Up, oh, down. Ooh, I can jump off that little edge there. Am I supposed to do that? I can just jump down like that? Alright, cool. VV. Look who's there. Stop sulking around already. I wasn't sulking. I'm here to give precious information. Look, the shrooms. Have la pheromones. If we walk into the black thing, they'll attack us. So I have to avoid this black smoke, right? You can try, but uh, we can't avoid all. But if you need a bit of warm-up, feel free to walk right into it. It's up to you. But don't put yourself in any danger. Our cells... There's no danger for you. You're already dead. Sulking again, I see. <sighs> Alright. There's nothing in the pot. Sage. I didn't walk into it. I walked against the wall. Well, that is a bug. They did say that was that was deemed to happen. I think in the first fight. Oh. Oh, I don't control her? Infection. Infection. Oh shit. Give me that. Give me that. I don't think I clocked the other soul. I wasn't paying attention. Okay. So we're going around. Alright. Nothing underneath the stairwell. Nothing over here. Nothing around the pen. Nothing on this side. Okay. That thing was heat seeking. I couldn't avoid it. Alright. Your soul, your soul is mine. Dispatch points. Oh, I leveled up. Okay. Strength, magic 11. I will increase. So strength is just like standard attacks. So it influences the damage dealt by physical attacks. Okay. Influences resistance to physical attack with magical hit points. Okay. Um. Magic. Magic dealt to the damage but dealt by the magic attacks. Willpower. 
Propel influences resistant to magic attacks, or the Necromancer also determines the mag maximum mana in the minimum regeneration rate. Okay. So I have two Dispatch points. I'm going to put one in Endurance. I see we're already at like this. I want to try to get as like max, or like to match it out maybe. Because obviously you're going to use this if you don't have magic. But you need more magic if you need that, so. I'm going to have this one. Okay. Vita. So it's a healing. No, hold the one so there's a magic down damage. Deal targets at four enemy. T oh, sorry, enemy four times per second. Increase the okay. damage down cost of mana the per life chunk. Okay, interesting. So that's not a healing magic, but it's kind of, in a sense. Okay. Well, now that's hurry and get. Let now let's hurry and get out of the goddamn castle. Yeah, but the castle looks quite big. Do you have the map? A map? Sure, I've never leave without a map every freaking castle in this region. Right. But let me see. We're on the top of the highest tower. Let's just take every descending stair and we should find the Agnes easily. Got it. We're all moving down. Okay, always move down. Got it. But the next time we are sca salvaging, a, sorry, scavenging a castle, I want a map. I like this. It's adorable. <laughs> Alright. Fuck is this? Might as well not even try to dodge it. I'm not fast enough to move that fast away from them. So every time you're gonna run into contact with them, they're gonna hit you. There's no way to there's no way to outrun them. Necroviathan, there are more enemies than I expected. Um, it's almost like they're guarding a castle from a necromancer, a very powerful necromancer from never waking up, and that you put here. You should know your own guard duty. You put me here. Fuck you mean, BB. <laughs> if we're just the two of us, we'll have a hard time getting out of the castle. Now I also think about it too, is she I wonder how long she she lived until she died before she came here to actually wake him up. Cause she also didn't explain what she wanted from him either. She was like, Oh, there's fighting in the castle that I put the necromancer, I should probably go up there and see what's going on. Because she's still relatively powerful as a spirit. Is she trying to become human again? Is she trying to come back to life? Is my best get coming to him being a necromancer would be to her best bet to coming back to life. He's like, oh yeah, I used to basically not be friends with this person. I killed him. Or didn't kill him, but I put him in a r extremely restless sleep. So it's like... I fucked up and now I'm dead. Now I have to go to my enemy and become befriend him. Because I want to come back now. I'm not... I have unfinished business. If we're just the two of us, we're going to have the hard time getting out of this castle. Is this like a story that because like enemies become lovers kind of story? If it is, I'm fine with it. Because it kind of seems like a rom-com already. I kind of like it. I don't quite like, like that, but don't you have a plan to use your soul possession skill? Or they just become good friends. We're not two either one. It's fine. Uh, a soul possession skill sounds fun. How does it work? You don't remember it? It's your very own super secret technique. If it's so secret, how do you know about it? <laughs> oh yes, it's all coming back to me. First, I must absorb enough souls to create the soul vessel. Interesting. Okay. So I just had to drag the souls in the soul vessel, rather than myself. Okay. Sounds simple. Let's try. Ah. 
I put it up there. Bullshit. Oh, okay, congratulations. You just captured your first soul. Excellent. After your combat, you'll be able to add you to your team. I broke it! <laughs> I, t I don't think I was supposed to do that. <laughs> It couldn't keep up. It's like, I'm only supposed to attack him four times. I just attacked that thing like 30 times. I don't think I was supposed to do that. <laughs> I just didn't let go. I was like, da 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 You captured a soul, click the sad team. Okay, interesting. The shroom skills. Okay, so I can just drag and drop. Okay, I like that. Also set to try your party and then it's a combat. Interesting. They have a shroom captain I can get. They have an unknown. They have four. They have that one. So we have six. Six different variations. They're not known yet. They have none that are known. Oh, they do. Okay, so they, they do have what they're called. If you actually go over and expand over them. So demon wizard is the highest class. They have straight demons. They have... Red cherubs. They have a normal cherub. Elite. Why? Is it imps? It's imps. Yeah, these are just imps just spelled really, really weird. But it's an imp. I have an imp. A Volks. Volks. Now I should have a, a, a Vox. I'm not sure what a Vox is. They're a healer. Oh, okay. I'm not really sure what that is. By the way, this is also a game that came out of Belgium, so it is going to be a little different. Because it's... I imagine there is going to be some slight transition things, plus also fantasy and meme haha -ha stuff. Uh, pink Seraph. Seraph? You can get a fucking angel before you get a cherub. That's interesting. But yeah, that's an angel. Seraph is an angel. And a standard one. So I'm guessing that's like a shiny variation. A Veeks. Not really sure what a Veeks is. Veeks Warrior. A Scarabs. A Blue Rapidors. Is it just a Raptor? You get a dinosaur as a fucking enemy? That's awesome. We got our red raptors. Green raptors. Blue mu a mums. The tank. Darkness. Is it a mummy? Red mums. Ancient meow. Meows. So it's a cat. <laughs> Meows. Uh. A blue ink. Inkulazul? I'm not really sure what that is. Ankulazul. Rat Elite. Rats Elite. Rats. Grooms? Ow. That was hurtful. Groom Sergeant. Grooms. Uh. Ams. How's it going, Mew? How's the how's the updates, Ams? A flame thread? Flames again. Uh blue wolves to get a dog. Ooh. Okay. Ice rocks. Rocks. A fire zard. I'm guessing this is like a dragon. An owl. Another owl. A red flies. So there's a fly. An ice deer. An ice deers. 
That's interesting. A bit slow due to the storm. So now I understand. Uh, if you guys are in terrible condition over there, I really... Seek shelter. Do what you gotta do. Hopefully your power comes back or that's going on. I, I hope it's a deep best right now. My dad's over down there as well. So good luck with that. Rotten peers. Peers. Cats. Another cat. A dark spears? Is that like a fish? Is that literally a spear? A levy? I'm not really sure what a yellow levy is. And they got more shrooms. Okay. So that's all of them from the list, which is pretty cool. It's a pretty good category of a bunch of different characters. There's a. Uh... 54 different companions you can get, which is a very good amount. Honestly. I like the way they do that. That's, uh, that's good. And they have a bunch of skill trees, a bunch of that stuff, too. But yeah. That's, that's a, that's a pretty good... It's pretty good. There you go. That mob is my slave now. It will be, it will fight for me. I can also ask him to clean up my house, or to Massage my does. Convenient. But fighting should be enough for the time being. Alright. Can I break these? I can't. Ooh, only five? I'm okay with that. I came from this way, right? Did I? No, I didn't. Ah! Oh, cool. We found a rejuvenation spot. Okay. If you get close to it, our party will be fully healed. Cool. However, that will make all monsters come back. Okay, so it's kind of like Dark Souls. Um, let's see... It almost works as a checkpoint if something bad happens to us. Okay. Okay, I got it. I'm like half health, so I probably should. There's nothing in that's empty. It says there's a treasure there. So there's treasure this way. I'm gonna run into a trap, aren't I? Fucker. Just fucking. Morte. Infecto. Infecto. Okay, so that ability just you can you can activate that ability as many times as you have the points for. Okay. Got it. Now All souls captured. Sadly I couldn't get the dino. It just didn't fill. Which kind of sucks, which means you can only fill it during certain times. The hell? Oh, okay, I just thought my staff turned to a sword for a sec. This is a very interesting area, by the way. There's no dino. What the hell? Why is there one over here? Oh, it's mine. Nice. 
You should be sorry. No! 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 I couldn't! No! God damn it! So I didn't go this way. There was an option to go that way. I think there was another different way this way too. Yeah, it, it says to go this way. Interesting. Your stuff. Give me your soul. Hell yeah. Right. So I'm guessing that might lead out. So we're gonna go back. Does that mean I can just farm this area? Does me in this farm this area. There's the dino. I'm going to take your soul, dino. Give me your soul. Congratulations, you have captured our soul. Fantastic. Now let's kill all the guys. Monte. Give me. No. You're mine. Soul, thank you. I have unlocked a dino. Dino. Interesting. Hold the heel. Passive baseball champion. Adjacent support defense. Interesting. Level four. Come here. Fight me. Dino attack. Morte. Death. Death upon you. Infection. No, you're mine. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. 
Okay. Victory! Nice. This game is actually pretty fun. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, he's so cute. No! Alright. It's fine. I'm gonna go back. I'm going back. I wanna get that fox thing. I'm going back. Which actually, this actually creates more playability, almost like a Souls-like, which I like. Because then I have to go back and then fight the monsters again, which isn't a big deal. But, like, I want that monster. It's a door. Ow. Morte. Attack. Morte. Infecto. Infecto Carizio. Morte. Let me also. I'll be taking that. Nice. Time with the the cute fox then. The jars don't reappear though, so it's interesting. Fox then. I will kill him first. Marte. Marte. Grab his soul, put it in the hole. I put it in the hole, but it didn't say I collected him. Oh, it did. Okay. The cats. It's adorable. It's cute. These are like audio level up. Hmm. Interesting. Heal. Heal. I can't heal him. I heal him. Let's move forth. Oh! Ooh, it's in our cats. Fight. Marte. Oh no, not the soul. Mine. <laughs> oh my god, I caught that. Alright, fantastic. Next, next, next. Ooh, skill. Let's learn a new skill. What does that do? Cast a free spot to summon a skeleton. Interesting. More health, and then.
Kind of checking out the corners to make sure there's no one, nothing I can just slip through. I know with my game, like some patches, like they're not fully like recognizable, so it's good. All the corners are good. Let's continue. Continue. Keep going. Fight me. Infecto. Infecto. Mate. Skeletus. Skeletos. What? Take me. Give me your soul. Feel so. I'll be taking that. Water. I'll be taking that. The hell's that? Was a random rat that can just crawl across? I didn't know that. Can I shoot the random rat? This one's a door right there. Is there not a door right there? Touch me. Skeletos attack. Infecto. Infecto. Ah. Yeah, so. Ah. You bet so. Thank you. Excellent. I've probably been through here, right? Oh, over here. Oh, BB. Actually, how did you wake me up? I hope you didn't have to kiss me or something. Yuck. Are you serious? In that case, you would still be sleeping. I'd never try to be funny again. Leave or castle? Chest. Oh, I, I left. Interesting. Wait, hold on. Pot. Must crush pot. Anything new? Oh, it's an owl! Oh, yeah! Team. Why did it have me with that? Use the power crystal here. Holds right in the mouse to heal an ally. Interesting. Interesting. Cool. Alright. Anyways. Mortal! Uh Skeletos. I now acquired an owl. Collected a friend, a brand new friend. Oop. He looks so sleepy. Level up, let's go. Does the level up heal them? The level up does not heal him. That's good to know. Most games, they usually have them healed after a uh, level up. But in this game, they don't. That's fine. You know, you don't, it's not, it's not something that needs to be added, but it is an interesting choice. Water. 
Welcome to the inventory. Would you like a quick tutorial? I don't really need one. I'm good with that. Trinkets. Water. Do I not have trinkets? So I have stuff for me. But she has trinkets while I have stabs. Interesting. And then I have these. I have no tokens, it looks like, but there's different things that kind of opened up. And I can explore different routes based on what I have. Yeah, so I have, I have none of that, which is fine. Okay, so each individual thing doesn't have coins. It's just, it's a shared coin system. Okay. And then... Okay, I do like how they all kind of like separate into different vines, though. It's not just the same vine every time. I like that it kind of changes. That's kind of cool. I like that. That's a little cool little bit. This is actually a very long demo, too. I'm worried if, like, I leave here, I think it's going to, like, cause me to, uh, the end of the demo. But I do like the game so far, so I'm okay if it, the demo ends. It's already been an hour demo, so, like, can't be that bad. And I've collected a full party, which is cool. Attack. Monte. Oh! One, one hit kill that guy. Give me, no, give me your soul. Where are you going? Give me your soul. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye now. Excellent. Okay, no downward spiral. Cool. Going this way. Click that. Down here, nothing there. Interesting. I'm gonna on purpose get hit. See if there's anything new. So there's a blue commander, which is cool. I need to still get new ones, so I probably actually grab him. I'm gonna attempt to infect them first. Oh shit, no! Oh, I missed it. Give me that soul. back and grab him then. I think it's all the way back here. So I don't think there's another one. There's one down here somewhere. Yeah, I never saw this fight. So there is one here. So I can just grab this one. So I don't have to go back. Mate. Mate. Give me that. Mate. Mate. That soul in the hole. There we go. Okay, now I don't have to go back. But now I have more friends. I have a shroom captain now. This is level 3, this is level 4, not a big deal. I think I'm just gonna swap him out for him. Um. Yeah, I should be fine. Freezing strike. It has all the same stuff, but it has a freezing strike now, so that's cool. Collected all the things. I have all these monsters so far. What is the healing status of these? 
Okay, so let's go, let's heal him. Can we not heal him? Okay, yeah, we can't. Not a big deal. Uh, we're gonna go back to the main area. We're gonna go the outro, so that's the exit. It appears to be, that's what that sign is for. Attack, attack, attack. Okay, give me soul. Infect him. Nice. Give me that soul. That's mine now. Excellent. Delicious. No, 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 no. The mine. <laughs> I was so close to losing that. Oh, good. I come from here. What shit did I come from? Pots. I don't want to lose my way, but. So what's this way? I'm just trying to like figure out this place, trying to check it all out. seven life chunks from a random enemy. That's cool. I don't want the Morte, though. Will down to his son. 12 seconds. HP. Seven. Special Necroviathan stats manually. Yes. Forgot about that. Alright, uh... Let's go with his max health. Go to 7. What's a star for? Where's this way go? Where's this way go? I was already this way. Okay, so this must be the other the other way I took after I took the um the energy shield thing. Yeah, okay. And yeah, no new characters, cool. Okay. Skeletor. Skeletus! Attack. Oh wow. Got a lightning attack. Okay. 
Nice. Let's go back down. Hmm. Oh. Ooh, nice. Let's go back down. Okay, so there's our life orb. Don't need that. We're gonna keep moving. Starting to turn really gray now. At the end. He 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 he. He 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 he. My pawn has finally awoke. Pawn? Am I an apprentice of a much larger, like, necromancer? Things will start to be interesting. Weird how these perils are shaped. Yeah, there's nothing there. There is a black abyss over here. Oh, it's a big boy. N jokes on you, I can absorb you. <laughs> Destroying the red mushroom. What, how dare you compare me to these blue runts? I'll make you pay with these, <laughs> these midgets. <laughs> It's outright just calls them midgets. Okay. Water. Skeletos. Yeah. Infectus. I'll be taking that. Deliciosa. Oh, I can't. I can't take his? Bullshit. <laughs> Him fan square, I should be able to capture him. There you go, it was easy. Hey, ghost, how much time did I pass in the slumber? I'd say a bit more than five years. Five years? Why didn't anyone free me earlier? Well, first, no one wanted you around. Creating a scavenging skeleton army isn't the best way to raise your popularity score, really. Valid point. And after that, there wasn't anyone left to free you. You are the last human alive. So I'm ultimately... So I'm the ultimate winner of the Grand Battle Royal of real life. How cool is that? Stop bragging. We have to help those people actually the reason why I freed you. You will help me bring back to life, them back to life. No way, I have myself I've, eh. no way, I have myself tried to destroy the human race in the past. Their disappearance is a good news to me. But if you are the last human alive, there is no 
No one to talk to. No one to love. Perfect. An idea. An ideal world. I finally have some tranquility. Nobody to fear. Nobody the to torment. Nobody the to martyr. You're trying to fool me. I'm not taking the bait. Anyway, I haunt you until you change your mind. I will talk to you all the time, even by night. Ghosts never sleep. Jeez. Alright, tell me more where I can have the go, then shut up until we arrive. If I hear some, some of your voice, I'll change my mind. Promised. I'll be quiet as a grave. No clue if graves are supposed to be quite quiet for necromancers, but you get the idea. We have to reach the forest of Cornelius? Corni Cornelius? No, it's Cornus. Follow the road to the north. We'll find you. Oh, let's go. Ah, teleportation. I was kind of testing for different kind of, like, extra things. Obviously, he seemed to have the edges pretty well versed. <laughs> see if I can run it. Nope. Fight. Oh, okay. Robin, did he not have a soul? Mark. A red soul. It will attack your team. You must capture it. Oh, that's not what I wanted. How do I get rid of that? Is there a way to accident like how do I how do I get rid of him are you wanting to free this mob it will be forever lost yes oh if I free them it gives me health that's kind of cool interesting hmm. earth gone does that do? So is there a strength? Plus five strength. Twenty-five percent earth damage. Resistance to ice. What if I just jack her up? Just make her muscle mommy ghost. I seem right. I'm not gonna test all of them for time, obviously. It's not really. So you know, the test is done pretty good with the edging. They've edged pretty well. There's a monster demon in this location. Well, that didn't take long. Jeez, one of the heavy punches. I'm totally rude. That's with the demon. But nobody ever listens to me. Ah, oh, shut up. The others should have taken care of it. Band-Aid Man! Alright. Mark. Mark.
turn into a demon and the spells may be less otherwise. Okay. Interesting. Demon Tower. Interesting. Can I outrun this thing? Does not appear that I can outrun this thing. <laughs> I can't outrun it. Ooh, that's an interesting character. Just saw that. Ring of Endurance. Ring of Endurance. Got your ring. I'm sure there's more she can get. Like an extra ability to get like more than one or two. Get a chance to grab it. With a yellow beam. I get a chance to grab it, sadly. said to go here. Let's go here. Yes, Vivi. And he is the forest of the Conus. My destination. Hmm. Can I speak again when you hardly say nothing for such a long time? So tell me, why are you here? For the force can illusions to bring the humans back to life. Be warned that only I can bring back the undead. Not very evil of fate. I know that the brute there is a way to make an island up in for the real. For that we should go to the some place not ultra simple to reach. The realm of the dead. The underworld. How do you plan me to bring us there? If it means killing me, you can find someone else. Don't worry, I found a portal allowing us to go there safely. Let us go to the heart of the forest. I will tell you more once we're there. I do like this game a lot, though. I'm really, I'm kind of happy that, uh, what was it, R RG told me about it? Because, like, this game's kind of awesome. It's like real build games or something like that. Because I like this game a lot. It's a lot of fun. No, 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 no. Damn. 
What the hell is that? Is that a pear? I'm gonna capture that pear. Death to you, pear. I'm capturing you. Infecto. No. My. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. I want to look fast. Swap out the pear for uh, the, the shrooms. He's a fighter. Fighter class. Tank. Mage. A healer? Probably heal up the healer, right? Oh, heal up the mage. Okay. Yes, VV. Oh, I almost forgot. I did something special for you while you were hanging around. Okay. I created a map, because you complained about me not having a fucking map, so I created a map. This is me, and this is you, and we will go up to this direction. It's not a very accurate map, but it will take you from point A to point B. What is this thing? It's a map of the forest. I made it myself. Thanks, that's nice. Not bad. It's crap. Honestly, it is crap, but I want to tell her crap because I like Vivi. I don't know if she has the greatest intentions, but I kind of like Vivi. She seems to grow on you. <laughs> but I am nice. <laughs> now it's your turn to offer me a gift. Hold your horses. <laughs> she comes back with horses. I'm holding thine horses. I'm just trying to get the, uh, what the hell? Water. Infected. Let's go this way around. Okay, there's dust over here, so this is an exit. It says go up and around. Well, it's not it's not quite up and around, but it's fine. Okay, well technically they were right. I feel they should have more of like a downward spiral. If that was Playing in the grass, Necro. It must be all cut in half. Round, and they said up and around. I'm not gonna do any extra fighting, I'm just gonna get from point A to point B, just kinda like get to the demo. Nah. 
I'll continue playing this, obviously. Oh no! The fluffy man's down. Defeat? I perished? Get up, Necro. If you can do it, you can do it. Okay. I hear this down. Oh no. Bad. That was almost really bad. I learned the new spell, Erupto. Cast a poisonous enemy to consume the poison in the explosion. Oh, that's kind of cool. Need more endurance. So I almost perished. So I have a level up with something else, but I'm good. So where is this portal? Portal which are you talking about? You're making fun of me. You told me that the portal was a t for the underground was in the forest. I never said that. It's the seal to break to activate the portal which is located in the forest. What? But you never told me about the seal to break the seal? It's nearly the same, just a slightly detour. We break the seal and then, poof, we have access to the, the, the cake. It sounds too easy. I hope there's something hiding or something. Not at all. Don't worry, Clone of you. Damn it, VV. Should have known. It was never that easy. He's different. No! Don't you perish on me. Come on. Come on. Oh, in fact, I... Oh, mana. Oh, mana. Come on. Come on, come on. It's a close battle. Come on. Oh, I have a leaf man. But everyone's dead. Everyone's so perishing. I 
kind of exact is what 10% chance of big X. It's not getting there. I might die here. Oh. Well, this is not good. that it appears I have to fight that so this is the that infernal spirit you were talking about it looks like it's rather like a giant pair not a spirit but likely a guard down the natural hasn't gone crazy lately many of plants started taking humanoid shapes like this mushrooms and we saw earlier that plants belong with fungal kingdom I'm not a science lecture. I didn't ask for a science lecture. Focus on the combat, damn it. Alright, fine. Dick. <laughs> Attack him. Come great poison. Skeletos. Start using that aggressively and just like healing all the units. Oh, 
Oh my god, what the fuck just happened? What? Why we're on a different plane now? What just happened? I didn't know they could just do that. Thanks for playing Necrostory. Add Necrostory to your stream wish list and join us on the Discord. This save will be usable in the final game. That's awesome. That's amazing. They're... They don't do that for like any other games. If you play the demo or the betas, none of your saves are saved. That's amazing. Why don't more people do that? This game actually, this game dev actually cares about its people and their community. Imagine that. That's amazing. I love that. But anyways, thank you for joining us on this epic journey of an hour and 42 minutes of playing this game. Um, I'll be definitely posting this up on YouTube and everything as well. We have an edited version of more of like what to look out for, different builds, different customizations, and a few other things as well. So stay tuned to different updates. Uh, it'll be coming out October 7th, so keep your eye out and grab it. Grab as fast as you can. It's a lot of very fun game to check out, so I highly recommend it. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to continue probably playing this, but I'm going to do it in a different stream. This stream is just mainly for this. But, uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. I definitely, there's a lot of things that I like about it. I probably gave it like a, it's like a, a 9 out of 10. I mean, because there is, there is slight things that kind of, like, I feel they could have did better with their uh, mechanics. As of bugs, I haven't really found any bugs, really, other than, like, maybe two of them. Um, but, no, it's it's really good. Um, I look forward to checking out their dungeons and more of their demon towers and everything as well. When this game actually releases, I'm going to go try to say if I can pick it up. Or, you know, they can slide me a code. That's cool, too. But, anyways, um, yeah, this is fantastic. I look forward to it. And, uh... I will I will see you in a few guys in a few minutes. Thank you for watching. What was that?